The new GX IO Extender 150 increases the number of inputs, outputs and relays available to a GX device. With a smaller physical footprint than a Serbo GX, the extender is powered and controlled over USB. Across the top there are two latching relays. They can switch low power AC and DC signals and because they are latched, they'll remain in their position if the power is lost. Under each relay, an LED indicates its state, channel A or B. At the top right of the extender is a solid switch for DC loads and it can handle all types, resistive, capacitive and inductive. The solid switch handles a maximum of 4 amps for DC loads only and has a load on LED indicator. Across the bottom are 8 digital inputs or outputs provided in two banks of four each. Dip switches determine whether channels 1 to 4 and 5 to 8 are set as inputs or outputs. Once again, individual LEDs indicate the state of each of the eight channels. At the bottom right is a four channel pulse width modulation output. The four LED lights turn on when the output is enabled and the intensity of the LED matches the PWM level. The extender is fully supported in Venus OS Node Red, making automation and custom logic easy. The digital outputs and relays can be controlled from the new switch pane on the GX device's screen, as well as remotely over the internet using the VOM portal. This allows you to monitor and control the switches and sliders from anywhere in the world. The GX IO Extender 150 has been a highly requested item, with its easy pluggable spring terminals for fast and secure connections, it enables endless seamless integrations, and multiple extenders can be added to increase the connections even further. Mm -hmm.